Welcome back, everyone. Well, it's fair time, which means lots of food, and Donnie is here with us today. <laughs> Talking about the best and worst of fair cuisine. I don't know that yeah. we want to know all of this information <laughs> before we head out to the fair. Well, I mean, let's be honest. There's really not much that's healthy at the fair. I can't Unless maybe anything. bottled water. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, I don't think anybody's selling salads there. That's uh, well, sure. I don't think so. I mean, I, I went to the YMBL's website, and I actually pulled mm -hmm. the list of all of the food and beverage vendors. Mm -hmm. And I went through, and I found some of the most popular ones, like the things that I would eat. Because, right. yes, I will go to the fair, I will go, I will eat, and I'll pay for it for probably three or four days. <laughs> yeah. But I pulled some of the most common things, and then there's this great website that I found. Mm -hmm. And even though doctors and nutritionists kind of, we advise against counting calories as a science, it's just not real, right. it's not really the right way to, to try to lose weight. But everybody identifies with calorie counts. So just mm -hmm. for fun, I went on this website, and I looked at the calorie counts of some of the most popular fair food, and I was just blown away. I was blown away. <laughs> oh, scared to hear this. Okay, let's talk about probably the worst. Okay. It's going to be those donut burgers. Oh. It's a donut that's a cheeseburger. <clears throat> I've never had one. I don't think I would I would try to eat one. I really seen, don't. I've never seen that. 555 calories. But here's the kicker with that. 38 grams of fat. I mean, the fat is just that's that's what really gets you with that. Funnel cakes, 276 calories, 15 grams of fat. Um, fried Oreos. And now that's a big one. Fried Oreos usually come in four or five to mm -hmm. a little a little tray. 891 calories. Oh my God. That's almost your full daily allotment of calories if you eat a 1500 calorie diet. In I mean, that is little crazy. Container. Right. <laughs> and then ice cream. And this is something that you can get at other places besides the fair, but the big waffle cones or the oh, waffle yeah. bowls, mm -hmm. 935 calories. That's just in the bowl? The waffle bowl. Yes. Wow. That, it's crazy. And then some of the things that you like, um, <laughs> cotton candy, here we go, a, a regular size cotton uh -huh. candy on the stick or the big bag, right. 220 calories. <sighs> can you eat the whole thing though? Do you oh, eat the whole thing? Oh, I can not only <laughs> eat the whole thing, but if I have a second bag, I can start working on it. I have to hide the second bag for myself. Now, here's some other things that were surprising. Pork mm -hmm. kebabs, they're actually lower in calories. So that's something that's kind of healthy. I mean, some people think, you know, pork is the other white right. meat and it's kind of low in fat. So 130 calories there. Um, the other thing that is relatively healthy, if you take the skin off, are the smoked turkey legs. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's that 151 sense. calories. So, you know, take the skin off of it. It's, those are okay. Um, gosh. Some of my favorite things, like the fajita quesadillas, mm -hmm. anywhere from 400 to 800 calories, wow. depending on whether it's chicken or, um, or beef. Beignets, there's going to be somebody out there that's selling New Orleans style Ooh, beignets. Those are good. They are 527 calories mm -hmm. for three beignets. So there it goes. <laughs> so go exercise before, eat the turkey legs so you can have the fried <laughs> Yeah, now, here's the, speaking of exercise, this <laughs> website that I found, calorieking.com. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have that website This up right is now, really, actually. really a neat website. Um, when you mentioned exercise, it made me think this. Mm -hmm. When you pull up anything in particular, whether you pull up a corn dog or cotton candy okay. or fried Oreos. Let's pull up deep fried Oreos. It'll also show you over on the side what you have to do to oh, burn that number of calories to get rid of it. Yeah. It'll give you walking, jogging, swimming, and biking, and how many minutes of each you need to do to burn off those calories. Okay, so yes, those <laughs> deep fried Oreos will cost you 102 minutes of jogging or 247 yeah. minutes of walking. That's a whole lot of laps around the fairgrounds. And who has time <laughs> to do that? <laughs> yeah. Well, unless you go out there and you eat, and then you walk around for a couple hours afterwards, sure. which that's usually what we do, because I, to get all of that stuff to kind of go down, it's like... <laughs> You got to do something, and riding the rides is definitely not no, going to help. No, not a good department. idea. Don't eat all of this heavy calorie food and then try to ride the rides. Okay. But if you want to look and see what the food vendors are, just to get an idea of what's out there, and if you want to run some of them through, through the Calorie King on your own, right. uh, just go to ymbl.org. They do have a list that you can click on that will tell you all of the food and beverage vendors, mm -hmm. and then you can you know pick the ones that you really think you're going to go indulge in and then see what the damage is. Right. Map it all out before you even get out there. Right. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, Donnie.